Okay, back to the wonderful world of social media. And this video we're going to do is a real quick one on, let's get this one out of here, that's an old one, on how to set your name servers for Bluehost. So say you have a, you, you bought a domain on GoDaddy or whatever site you'd like to buy on. I like to use GoDaddy. So, um, and not just because the girl's on here either, um, although it's a nice, nice add-on. But basically, you buy, a, you buy a domain name and then you want to host a website. Well, I use Bluehost.com to host my websites. They have unlimited web hosting and, and things like that. They also now have dedicated hosting. But say you want to get your domain name and you want to host it on Bluehost. So that's what this tutorial is about. You get an account. I'm going to log into GoDaddy. First thing you're going to do is you're going to have to go to your domains, your domain management over here. Management, domain management. And then you want to find the, the I have you know 350 domains right now. So you want to find your domain. I use this little jump to box over here. And I, this, this one is going to be my social media rockstar.net. We're going to throw this up here. So we go social media rockstar. There it is. Click on it. You see it in the box. Click on your, click on your domain. And what you're going to do is you're going to come down here where it says name servers. Okay. And you are going to hit the button that says set name servers. Very simple. And you want to click the little button here that says I have specific name servers for my domains. So you want to go that. It's very simple. ns1.bluehost.com. That'll get you uh, hosting that will tell GoDaddy that you're hosting this domain at Bluehost. That's what you're doing. So you're telling them you're hosting this one, and this one has to be NS2. Um, so don't blow that. You got ns1.bluehost.com, and you got ns2.bluehost.com. So when you're done with that, simply press OK, notifying GoDaddy what you're doing. So you can get your domain, and it says here the changes usually take two hours. However, it may take up to 48 hours. I have found that it works very, very fast. And uh, so I'm going to go over. We're going to take a chance and see. I'm going to go over and see if by chance that uh, propagates, as they call it. So, so let's get out of here. So now we've done, we've done it on this side. Now we've got to go over to our Bluehost account. Okay. And your Bluehost account, log in, set up an account, do this. And then you want to come over here to your domains. It's a little screwed up, and I think it, maybe it's because of this Chrome browser that I'm using. Usually I use Safari, but I've, I recently switched to the Chrome for some, for some other marketing reasons. <clears throat> so go to your domains here. Redirecting. Hopefully that takes us to the right place. And I have an account set up here. I have, uh, have a few domains in here. So what you want to do is assign a domain to your cPanel account. You go there, and then you can see basically here, please type a valid domain. So I'm going to give it a try, see if it's in here, socialmediarockstar.net. Let's see, and they're trying to verify my domain to see if they've actually picked up that you're sending over the thing. And as you can see, ownership verified. So it did it very, very fast, propagated very fast. So, so put your domain in there, socialmediarockstar.net. And that's the site we're going to be creating, a site you're going to want to go back to in the future. We're going to post a lot of great content here, helpful tutorials like this to help you master your domain. So that's what we're trying to do. So, so it's verified the ownership. That's great. Um, typically, I just go right down here, and then it will create a, it will create a, uh, a new directory, social media rockstar. So let's go assign this domain. It'll actually be social media rockstar foreclosure warrior because this is under my my main account is foreclosure warrior. So that's my main account you'll see under there. So let's go assign the domain. Let's go assign the domain. And it will work like the speed of light. Let's try to hit it again here. Well, it's working up here, as you can see, up in the browser, it's actually working. So it means I need to just sit back and be patient. Okay. So we're there, and you can see now in my domains, we have social media rockstar, right? 
So that's how you assign a domain to your social media account. Now check back on another video because then I'm going to show you how to actually post a website up here so that you can take Social Media Rockstar and turn it into a website and you can see we're doing all this uh, literally in an hour. It's a website and you know pretty much a website in an hour type of thing and again Bluehost will give you a shared account where you're shared with a bunch of other people or will give you a dedicated account for extra money and uh, so if you have a you know big website you might want to go dedicated um, if not uh, the shared hosting which is what this is sort of all shared hosting should be fine so that's it for this one uh, but check in on the other video and watch me uh, launch social media rockstar and see how easy it is to get a business up on the web it really doesn't really doesn't take a whole lot at all so let's go let's go and end this here and we'll stop recording